pass. And as much as I got there at about 9.10, it's 9.35 now. As much as I would like to continue to rest, I should probably get going based on this cloud. So that's what I'm going to do. stuff and I ended up taking all that off. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, it's too hot. <laughs> yeah. That's good. Better than the other way around. Yeah. So how far are you hiking today? Uh let's see. Probably about probably around nine miles. Oh, yeah. yeah, I'm going to Lacan uh Canyon Ranger Station. Yeah. <laughs> that was a tough climb up, huh? That's what I'm doing, I'm just going the other way. Yeah, we're doing like 19 miles a day. I'm like, no, thank you. Yeah. 
They say Navy SEALs use those whistles too, but I don't know if that's true or not. And they also said that it can be used underwater, and I've tested that, and uh, that doesn't really work. <laughs> definitely a lot shorter distance but yeah, I mean sure. like I had somebody go into the water with me and they couldn't hear me uh, all, all, the, all they could all they could see was bubbles yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> another thing about that whistle is it floats it, what? it floats oh yeah that's good yeah. Yeah. Anyway, I told Allison, okay, if I haven't contacted you by 5 p.m., <laughs> call the ranger. Yeah. Or report me missing. I figure by like 5 p.m., I should already be at Bishop. And we'll have some little section somewhere. Yeah. You know? Hopefully. Yeah. I told my mom that if she doesn't hear from me by Sunday, because I'm supposed to get out Saturday, uh, uh, to yeah. contact them as well. Yeah, well, that's smart. Yeah. I don't know, might get delayed or something might happen. I don't know, but... Yeah, I mean, it's always, I guess, maybe good to sort of give you a day, but then it could be not good, you know, because... Yeah. Yeah, because, like, that day can make a huge difference between life or death. Yeah, absolutely. Beautiful. coming from today yeah just down there <laughs> oh okay yeah where are you headed uh i'm headed to lacan canyon oh okay yeah. cool it's beautiful good happy trails you too happy trails thanks in my hometown. <laughs> oh man, the triple digits. Yeah, you should hike one. Maybe I'll be out better.
ンチ越えてねえどこから来たのあ、なかなか遠いですね。あ、なかなか遠いですね。なかなか遠いですね。なかなか遠いですね。
um, really backpacking this season and kind of like mid-August. I was coming over Lamarck Call and I met people coming over as being like, oh yeah, man, like, you know, it's fine, when you get the Sapphire Lake, we had to fucking run for our lives. Or somebody else was like, yeah, I was down at like McClure Meadows and like, you know, we just had to hide in our tents. And you know, <laughs> oh, no. like, I got there and I'm like, yeah, there's, a, there's some mosquitoes, but they're fine. Yeah. And on my way out, I was talking to somebody. He's like, yeah, when we first got there, they were horrible. And then we had a cold night and they weren't bad anymore. And, <laughs> and that kind of happened to me on this trip, like on at Bench Lake. It was like, again, like not really bad, but they were there. You know what I mean? It's like, you kind of like, I spent two nights there and it's always kind of like, yeah, you know, once you really sit down for a while and start cooking, there's maybe five to 10 around you, you know, kind of like throughout like the first night, first morning, second night, and second morning there was like one. Like, Woohoo, cold nights. Yeah, really, huh? Yeah. <laughs> um, so yeah, like, it'll be fine. Okay, cool. Well, thank you so much for the information. I appreciate you're it. You're welcome. Yeah, it's always nice to know what you're getting into. Yeah, it is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How, how far do you think uh, Leconte is? Uh, I mean, downhill, less than two hours. Okay, cool. I mean, take your time. Like, the lower lake is really nice. I would just chill out there a bit. Uh, there's, like, a set of switchbacks, and there's a shelf, and there's a second set of switchbacks. Um, the first set is a little bit more aggressive. Um, the shelf has, you know, water sources to resupply at. Um, going down the second set is just, you know, single track, perfectly graded. You know, just, I mean, for switchbacks, they're nice. Oh, good. And there'll be a, a beautiful cascade um, to your left. You know, just like water skittering down granite. Um, yeah, and if you meet the ranger at the LeConte Ranger Station, like, he's pretty cool. Oh, did you see him there? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, I, like, I saw he signed in to a peak register in late July. I'm like, wow, oh, motherfucker. Like, I'm here. <laughs> if you, like, back this peak in July, like, so I, like, went there, like, hey, Sam. Ouch. And, like, I mean, I just kind of, like, chatting for, like, an hour or something. But, I mean, if you're looking for little side trips to do in the area or something, like, he's, you know, he just, he spends his summer at that ranger station. So, he yeah. The area. Yeah, that's great. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much. You're have welcome. a have, happy trails. Happy trails to you as well. <laughs> thank you. All right. How's it going? Good. How about you? Good. You you look like you're tired. I am tired. Where are you headed? Bishop Pass. Okay. Well, you're probably two and a half to three miles. Thank you. You're welcome. Have a good, have a good trip. After a season of night falls in pushbacks, after the heartache of wrong turns and sidetracks, just when they think they got you game set match. Here comes a comeback Just cause you lay